Hey everybody, what's up? And welcome back to Monster Legends Legend. And today I'm going to kind of show you some ways where you can get coins in order to get K911. So, I just did a video that I just uploaded maybe like half an hour ago showing the features of K911 and it was fun. So, if you guys want to check that out, kind of see what his skills are and kind of what he looks like in battle, I would suggest checking it out. But we are going to go to the maze dungeon. And this is a way to get lots and lots of coins. So I started out at 1768 coins. So we're going to see how many coins after all of these attacks, how much it gives me. So I would say that obviously this event has passed because this is a day late. But in the future, um, any of you guys who are new, don't ignore it. Oh, look, I got three gems. That'll make up for the 900 that I lost from the breeding event. Super. So anyways, like I was saying, this event has already passed. It's one day late, but I would recommend in the future when they have these mazes where you collect all of these coins, don't neglect these dungeons because these dungeons are going to produce a lot for you guys to help you get that monster that you want without having to spend any money. I mean, I know that's one of the big ways Monster Legends does things is pay to play, which really sucks for a lot of people who don't have that type of money. So this is just one option. This is one way for you guys to get the coins that you guys need in order to obtain that monster that you want. I shouldn't even say obtain. I should just say acquire. There you go. That's the word I was looking for, acquire. So I'm just kind of going through... This dungeon, just blowing past them. Um, I wonder if I should just change it up because I'm using, what is his name? Venom Tex all the time in this and it's, I have really strong monsters. So, I mean, it's this isn't really much of a challenge, but let me change it up. Let me see what else is out there. Let's see, and I'm gonna attack with this one and oh crap, that did nothing for me. <laughs> all right. A lesson learned. All right, we'll just go back to Venom Text to just take them all out because I really don't want to waste too much time on this attack part. I just want to show you guys that if you just keep pushing through, that eventually you're going to get a whole bunch of coins and it's going to really help you when you guys do the, the maze. So next one is at 110 coins, which is really good. That'll really help you out so like i said let's just let's just keep blowing past these so far with the rewards the only thing i've gotten that's worth anything is three gems that's it i mean i wish this gave you more options for gems but it's always the luck of the spin and if you're new though um don't sell this short because all of these will help you if you're brand new to this game but if you're more experienced i mean Finding these or getting these, I guess, rewards from these spins. It's like finding a penny on the floor. You know, it's not really worth picking up. So I wish that Monster Legends, they would give you rewards based off of how high you are in the game as far as experience wise. So I'm at a level, what, like 150, something like that. I think that's the max you can go to. So I wish that the rewards would be a little bit higher for those of us who are at a level 150 versus someone who's at a level 25. Because if you're at a level 150, you already know that these perks aren't, or rewards aren't really, you know, worth having. Like, it's not like, oh, I can't believe I got um, 10,000 in gold. Because chances are we have probably millions, hundreds of millions, or even, in my case, billions of gold. So this doesn't really add any value. But, I mean, like I said, if you are new to the game, this really helps. So we are going to wrap this up as far as this part of my demonstration. The last amount of coins is 280, which is really good. Let's just take care of business real quick. I want to see what K91... K911 does here, so I'm going to leave him alone. I want to see what type of attack he does, how strong it is. 
Okay, so it's not it's not too bad. But I'm gonna see what else he can do. I wanna see what other blows he can give to us or attacks, if you will. Oh forget it. If he's just gonna do the stamina regeneration and stuff like that, I'm just gonna finish him because I don't wanna wait on him. I'd rather just I want I was hoping he would have done the second attack, but that's okay. So those are some of the ways that's the first way to get them a lot of coins. I mean like you get a thousand. You get a thousand just for playing that. And that's great. And then there are lots of other opportunities. Don't forget though that Jack Russell is there. So the other opportunities that you can go through is I hate to say it, it's pay to play. It's the coin collector. I think that gives you like what? Fourteen coins for every fifteen minutes. So I think that's like nine hundred, I think, at the end. But I'm not really too sure. But the only way to get that, the coin con coin collector dude, is I think one of the passes. I don't know if it's the Legends Pass or I don't know if it's the Battle Pass. But it's one of those passes that you would have to actually spend money to get. But the other way of getting it is through the Maze Bank. Now, you get 450 for only 99 cents. So those of you who might have a little bit of money to spend and you want those coins... I would recommend that because it's always something that you can get. So let me know what you guys think of this in the comment section. If you liked the video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. But yes, I will talk to everybody later.